Now that we have our loom made and painted, we're going to strain the weft. Those are the vertical lines. First, slip a piece of yarn, a nice long piece of yarn, into one of these needles and then tie it onto the needle like that. Then you're going to take the needle, and the needle is just a piece of wire that's been twisted into like a needle shape. Pull your yarn all the way through, all the way to the very end, but not all the way so that it comes out. And then tie the end that does not have the needle. So you're tying the end that doesn't have the needle, just like you tie your shoelaces. Then take the needle and go to the opposite hole on the bottom and put your needle through and pull it all the way through and make that yarn nice and tight. You want these to be really nice and tight. Then you're going to put your yarn through the neighbor hole. Pull it all the way through. And then the opposite hole. And you're going to do this for the whole loop. Going through the neighbor hole and then the opposite. The neighbor, then the opposite. The neighbor, then the opposite. It's just like a pattern. I'm going to fast forward a little bit so you can see how I go through the neighbor and then through the opposite. As you can see, I pull the string through all the way each time and pull tight. Going to the neighbor, pulling it through, going up to the opposite side. When you get to the very last one, you're going to want to take it to a te to your teacher because then your teacher is going to make sure that there is not any slack left in your loom. You can cut off all of the extra you want enough to tie though. And here, see how I pull the slack out of the weft to make sure that the weft is nice and tight. And then make sure that last that last string is tied down nice and tight. So again, this should probably be the teacher's job to make sure that the weft is nice and taut. Then if you want to snip off that extra string, you can snip it off. Just make sure you don't cut the knot. And now we are ready to learn how to weave.